Hey guys, I want to do a quick video showing you how to mount a mirror on a door without any hardware to screw it in or attach it, but you will need some kind of adhesive. And I recommend getting some of this Velcro 3M tape. On one side, it's the harder part. On the other side, it's the soft part. And you attach them together. They work really well together. And you attach it to the mirror by simply peeling off the sticky part on the back and it attaches just like tape. Very easy to do, and of course, you wanna have a level to make sure that your mirror is level. All right, so let's get started. And of course, you need your mirror as well. And you're only working with the backside here to attach the tape. One important step is figuring out how high you want your mirror to be. So first off, bring it up to the door to get a good idea of where you want it. Now we're relatively short, so we don't need this thing to be too high, but about six inches above your head is typically pretty good. And just draw a line with a pen. And it's faint, but I've got my marking there. So that way when I mount this, it should be pretty simple to know exactly where you want to place it. So let's attach our adhesive to it. And now to attach the Velcro to the mirror using the adhesive side, of course. And yes, you will need scissors, but I know every household has one of those, so I did not include it in the list of things you need for the hardware. Now, what you'll see here is two different options, and try to keep these from getting stuck together as you're working with them, so set that aside. And this piece is obviously not going to be long enough to cover the entire circumference of this mirror. So what you can do is actually cut it into smaller pieces, because this is not that heavy of a mirror. So it's not going to need too much to hold it up. And again, this doesn't have to be rocket science. You don't have to have pieces that are all the exact same equal length. I'm just going to use my shortest pieces along the top and the bottom. And you want to make sure as you're doing this, you don't put it on the concave side of the mirror because it's not going to get as good of an attachment, you want to make sure you're doing it along the hard edges that are flat. And the most fun you're going to have in this whole process is trying to get the tape off the adhesive side of these. So have some patience. And as you can see, I'm putting the Velcro more towards the top of the mirror just because I feel that's going to offer more benefit to keeping it attached. All right, and now that your last piece is attached, you're gonna cut similar sized pieces off the other piece of tape because you're gonna just simply attach these to this, remove the tape, and then press it up against the door, and then this adhesive will attach to the door, but the Velcro will keep it attached to the tape. Now, remove the piece so that way you're not pressing it too firmly against the other piece of Velcro. So you can remove the tape. And simply lightly press it on with just the ends. All right, now that we've got our tape attached, let's go get it mounted. And find your line here. Make sure you've got your level and how you want the mirror positioned. Simply attach your level to the top, find your approximate line, use the level, and once you're confident with it, just press it firmly in place. Now 
And there you have it. Your mirror is hung. Thank you for watching. I hope this helped you. And if you find this valuable in any way, please give me a thumbs up and a subscribe wouldn't hurt either. All right, take care.